are back here on Girl Talk. I am with my dear friend, Michelle Taylor. We are at Birdie James. It's the most incredible place ever. Wow. I love it. Um, I, ha I do have to say that we are cheating today. We're starting early in the morning. Why? Because we needed a few extra moments to do some personal shopping. Yes. And I already said, do you have any more of these? And she said, no. And I said, that's okay. Can I buy it off your <laughs> back? And she goes, hmm, let me think. Exactly. But it's a treat to see you. And we're really excited that we're going to be doing these with you. I think it's going to give everybody an opportunity just to see how broad spectrum Birdie mm -hmm. James really is. I'm excited for it to be in Birdie James um, and to have the time one-on-one -on -one with you as I, well. I mean, I'm really thrilled. One of the things that's interesting is the home pieces that you have here as well as fashion. Yeah, I'm really excited about this collaboration. Um, this is actually a client of ours and a small business owner in Norfolk, Virginia. Um, her name is Ann Temple Smith, and I follow her on Instagram. When she came to shop in here, we connected. We talked about being small business owners, and when she um, went back, you know, we went back to our respective offices, right? And we decided to follow one another on Instagram, and I've been following her ever since. And I noticed one day that she was she had this post where she was free free drawing mm -hmm. these pieces because she was stuck. And so I I thought for a second, you know, there's many times where when I have to give Birdie James an overhaul or go around and re reorganize or re-merchandise to freshen things up, I'm, I'm stuck too. I'm caught with 15 hangers on one arm <laughs> and that's just the process that you have to start at. Right. You know, it, it being stuck is important. Mm -hmm. And there was such a positive, um, this was such a positive Energy, way of being yes. stuck to me and so she works through it. And so I, I called her up and I said, we've got to do something together. Can you draw me? some of these and I want to have them in the store for, as a reminder mm -hmm. that when once you get through to the other side it's really beautiful. I love it. So, um, But kind of someone that I look up to on the island um, is Heather over at Louette. Yes. She does a great job. Heather with, Quinn. She mm -hmm. does such a great job with the home accessories and, and pulling things together. You know it feels kind of has that anthropology feel to it you mm -hmm. know which everyone loves. In this store there are times when you know we have countless pieces of clothing in here and women will bring up a vase that I have on a shelf right. or the little birdie and say, how much is this? And I'm like, it's not for sale. Exactly. Well, now it is. Well, and I, and I have to speak to that. So I brought all my grandkids in. Do you remember that? Yes. <laughs> and my, my Brooke, one of my grandchildren was, this is like an amazing place. It just feels so good. And she- The rugs. The rugs. Yeah. We ended up buying one. It was pretty incredible. So I think from a merchandising point of view, it doesn't get any better, but there's always something different. Every single time I come in, I see different things. And I laughed again. It was very easy to get dressed this morning because I have things that I didn't buy today. I've bought throughout the time you've been open. Right. I still pull them together. And you've bought these during different times of year too. Which is which awesome. Means that we have a nice seasonless um, kind of spectrum in here. Yes. So we have a lot of things that you can wear year round. And because I have kids that are all over the board with age, mm -hmm. okay, I mean, I've got 20 year old kids, 40 year old kids, and I'm 60. There's something for everyone here, and I really can pitch it with, with um, honesty and frankness. One of the things that I asked you about today was because it's hot out, everybody's wearing sleeveless, I'm not thrilled about sleeveless all the time. Right. But I struggle because many of my dressier dresses or my tank tops are sleeveless. Right. And you were like, oh, Debbie. Well, that's something that's really common to your age demographic, mm -hmm. um, and, it, and frankly, it start, it's starting kind of right now. I'll be yeah. 35 <laughs> next week, actually, next Happy Wednesday. Happy birthday to Thank you. you. Uh -huh. So um, I'm starting to, mostly when I see myself in pictures, right. is when I go, oh, right. you know, hold Up your back shoulders down. back, Michelle, yeah, exactly. and, you know, <laughs> I hear my mother in my head, shoulders back and covering the arms, and so I found some really great pieces. They're actually, I'm calling them capelets. So, You've you seen them on the red carpet. You've seen them places where it's just, it kind of goes over the shoulder and you have a space for your arms to come out. Mm -hmm. So we have a really fancy schmancy one by Ripley right. Raider, which is this oh, the really goal. beautiful I want champagne yes. sequins. Love it. Um, it's very 50s. Yes. It just, you know, it's cropped and it just goes over the shoulders. But then we have some very classic ones that are just plain white and plain mm -hmm. black. And they actually go on like a vest, so you don't have to fight with them to keep them on, which can be a little bit of the fear. Mm -hmm. And so also on our, our website at thebirdiejames.com, we have- Oh, go I, on, I, I was wrote, on it this morning. Yeah, I wrote an article about um, arm coverage, yes. because it is so important mm -hmm. to our client. 
And so we have lots of different um, pieces that are temperature appropriate too, mm -hmm. because it's so warm this time of year that women really struggle with being able to, they don't want to throw layers on right. because they just get so darn hot. Right. So we have sheer pieces and kimonos and things like that as well. It's funny, I can tell that you were in the mental health profession for a long time also because she, she really cares about your lifestyle and, and sort of your persona. Mm -hmm. Who are you? You know, how do you live? What do you want to do? What would make you comfortable? Right. Well, and yes, and yes, by the way, everybody looks better in a heel. <laughs> <laughs> I love when you put your leg up. Like I know. That. I can't help it. I no. She, no, I had to. She fought me to get. I'm not doing it. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's well. The thing is about what I love about styling women is that it is about taking the time to get to know them and their yeah. lifestyle. But also, it's just we see so many women in different shapes and sizes trying on pieces. So sometimes we know what looks best on you before you know, Oh, because I've seen your build before. Mm -hmm. um, I know what's going to drown you. If, if you're a certain height, I know what's going to elongate you. Exactly. You know what I mean? So, exactly. And and again, I talk about my kids because we, they've all been in here and I've got one that's five feet and one that's right. six feet. And it was really fun to watch them shop together. It's amazing when someone objective mm -hmm comes in, how important what we wear really is for how we feel about Absolutely. ourselves. It I is. mean, I think that's what's incredible. We've only got about 30 seconds. I want you to come in though, if you haven't had a chance, look at the clothing, it's fabulous. Look at the artwork and you will just leave feeling much better. I'm excited yeah. to continue to do this. And I am too. thank you, Michelle, for everything. We thank you all for joining us here on Girl Talk. Please have a wonderful week. Bye-bye.